Hey you, YouTube, it's Anthony again with another episode of Here in My Office. Um, just uh, wanted to make a little update video about uh, what's been going on lately. Um, I just made a video, um, but but uh, after that, Wells Fargo uh, reached out to me. And I know this, this is starting to sound like a broken record. It's starting to sound kind of ridiculous because I'm getting jobs. I had my last job, things were okay, and I left um, because I felt like I couldn't execute. I felt overwhelmed. I had to, I had to leave, and um, and I and I basically failed, I guess. But now, once again, Wells Fargo is coming back to me saying that um, they have a uh, lead, senior lead audit manager job. So it's pretty. It's still an individual contributor role. I wouldn't have um, people reporting to me. But um, I would have uh, the responsibility of completing audits, which is something that I already failed at doing, uh, at leading on my, in my last job. So at the same time, I'm also filing for disability. Um, so the question is, do I throw in the towel, go on disability because of my bipolar disorder, or do I... Um, give it another shot if I get the opportunity because there would be a, a second interview, a panel interview. And, um, you know, I'm, I, I have my notes. I think I'm ready for it. But uh, if I don't get this job at Wells Fargo, I would, I'm going to pursue the disability route. So um, what do you think, guys? Do you think I should um, give it another shot? try a new environment and this job is in Philadelphia I wouldn't have to commute to Delaware like I was commuting before uh, to do my job um, <clears throat> and the big difference is you know if I go on disability at disability it maxes out at like 3600 a month and I'd be making like 3000 a month on disability that that's like what the Social Security Administration calculated for me but if I go to Wells Fargo the pay is about one fifty a year, um, in that neighborhood. They told me in the fifth one fifties. So I would be making substantially more money every month um, working at Wells Fargo. But the question is: is do I have it in me to do the job, or am I too rusty from all the time I've been away from work and? Um, you know, because it's really been years since I ran an audit successfully. Uh, you'd have to go back to like 2016. So a lot of time has passed. Um, more like 2018, I should say. So five years. So um, I just feel like my, my skills have deteriorated um, from back before. And... Um, I'm also, you know, I had the diagnosis of bipolar disorder. So, um, and I don't want to, and I don't want to jeopardize being put on disability. Like if they, they say, Hey, what's the deal? Like if I get this job, then of course I got to stop the disability proceedings and, uh, say, I don't need this. I'm back in the workforce. Um, so, so I don't know. I don't know what's best for me. Part of me feels like I should just go on disability. Um, you're allowed to make a little money while you're on disability. So I don't I don't know what that would look like, what I would do, would I door dash, even though I don't like to door dash. But uh, it's a way to make some money that's not a lot of money that wouldn't disqualify you from disability. Um, and then my wife has her dog sitting business, dog walking business, and we can make money with that that um doesn't affect disability so uh it would just if being put on disability would mean uh i'm gonna have to downsize my house and uh you know live a live a more frugal lifestyle as opposed to if i worked at wells fargo but i really need to rebuild my um my nest egg my uh, life savings, basically, 
my 401k, all that stuff. Um, you know, that would be, I would be able to save a lot if I got the job at Wells Fargo, but, um, because on disability, the three grand a month would get burned up pretty quickly. So, so I don't know. That's the, that's the, uh, thing I'm grappling with lately is disability or no disability. What should I do? Um, and the application process is long. You're supposed to have a lawyer, so I do have one. Um, and it takes some time. So, but it's, it's, uh, now that I've been not working for about a month, I'm thinking maybe I'm ready to try again, give it another shot. And that's why I applied to jobs. And then, of course, then Wells Fargo interviewed me and it went okay. The first interview with HR. Um, so I'll probably find out this coming week if they want to pr proceed with me and give me a second round interview or a third round interview or whatever the case may be. But then am I just going to get in a job that I'm going to fail at again? I don't know. Um, I don't feel very confident lately. So, you know, that's the problem. So, and also this channel has been taking some, uh, I, I got a lot of views making shorts. Um, and I don't know if I'm going to change the direction of this channel to, um, dog videos and, or cooking videos and dog videos. Cause those seem to do better than here in my office. So stay tuned and you'll see, uh, new videos being put up and I do appreciate all the views. So if you're a subscriber, keep watching. And there will be here in my office videos. I will always update what's going on in my life. Uh, I've been given a lot of feedback that people like the transparency and the auth authenticity of the channel. So I don't want to lose that. But uh, I will be supplementing the videos with... You'll be seeing different kinds of videos I'll be trying uh, as I try to grow my subscribers and get my watch time up. So, uh, if you've watched this whole video, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up and uh, stay tuned for next time. So, thanks guys. Bye.